क्वेश्चन फाइव सेज दैट फ्रॉम द चॉइस गिवन बिलो चूज द इक्वेशन होज ग्राफ्स आर गिवन इन फोर पॉइंट सिक्स एंड फिगर फोर पॉइंट सेवन सो वी हैव दिस फिगर इन फोर पॉइंट सिक्स दिस ग्राफ एंड वी हैव दिस ग्राफ इन फोर पॉइंट सेवन एंड फॉर फोर पॉइंट सिक्स वी आर गिवन दिस फोर ऑप्शन ऑफ लीनियर इक्वेशन एंड वी हैव टू चूज विच वन इज करेक्ट विच वन कॉरेस्पॉन्ड्स टू दिस ग्राफ एंड सिमिलरली फॉर फोर पॉइंट सेवन वी आर गिवन दिस फोर ऑप्शन एंड वी हैव टू चूज विच ऑफ दिस फोर इक्वेशन कॉरेस्पॉन्ड्स टू दिस ग्राफ so this problem is actually quite simple from the graph that we have uh, so look at the graph of 4.6 we are given three points on this graph minus 1 comma 1 we have 0 comma 0 and we have 1 comma minus 1 we just need to check that these points uh, satisfy which of these four equations so we just need to check uh, that these points satisfy which of so let's take the first point which is minus 1 comma 1 so minus 1 comma 1 means x is equal to minus 1 and y is equal to 1 so from these four equations that we have we need to see which one is satisfied by minus 1 comma 1 so clearly the first one is not because the first one is y equal to x but the solution that we have in this case y is not equal to x so we can rule this out the second one is x plus y equal to 0 and yes we see that x plus y minus 1 plus 1 is equal to 0 so the second equation is satisfied by this solution the third one is y equal to 2x um but y is equal to 2x is not satisfied by uh, this these this pair of values so we can rule this out and the fourth fourth one is 2 plus 3y equal to 7x so if we substitute y equal to 1 uh on the left side we will get 2 plus 3 or 5 and if we substitute x equal to minus 1 on the right side we will get minus 7 so this is also not satisfied so the only equation which is satisfied by minus 1 comma 1 is x plus y equal to 0 and in this case therefore this will be the right choice we don't need to check any other point also because there is no other option available uh but if you want you can check the other points also so you can check that 0 comma Zero will also satisfy the second equation, and one comma minus one will also satisfy the second equation. So the answer for uh, figure four point six is the equation x plus y equal to zero. Now let's do the same thing for uh, figure four point seven. The first point that we have is minus one comma three. So x is equal to minus one and y is equal to three. Let's see which of these equations are satisfied by this pair of values. So y equal to x plus two is the first equation. If x is minus one, then x plus two will be one, but y is three. So the first equation is not satisfied by this pair of values. The second equation is y equal to x minus two. If x is minus one, then x minus two will be minus three, but y is three. So the second equation is also not satisfied. by this uh, pair of values the third equation is y equal to minus x plus 2 and let's see if this pair of values minus 1 comma 3 uh, satisfies this equation so if we substitute 3 y equal to 3 on the lhs we have 3 and if we substitute x equal to minus 1 then on the rhs we have minus of minus 1 plus 2 so on the rhs also i get 1 plus 2 or 3 So the third equation is satisfied by this pair of values minus one comma three, and this could therefore be the correct choice. But let's also look at the fourth, uh, the fourth equation. The fourth equation is x plus two y equal to six. So if we substitute uh, x equal to minus one and y equal to three, then we get minus one plus two y, or plus two into three or six on the LHS and Six on the RHS, so this is not correct, and therefore the fourth equation is also not satisfied by this pair of values minus one comma three. So the only equation uh, that is satisfied by minus one comma three is y equal to minus x plus two, and therefore this must be the correct choice. And you can verify that the other solutions zero comma two and two comma zero, they also lie on uh, the same line on the same equation. So the answer for figure 4.7 is this equation y equal to minus x plus 2, and this completes question number five.
To learn more about how QMath can help you crack school and board exams, explore QMath Leap, a live online classroom program run by highly experienced and committed teachers.